Bill, you play in a triple option team this week. I'm not sure what kind, but if you've uh, played against triple option before, I guess, in high school. Oh, know. yeah, I have. And, uh, What's that like? Playing against a triple option team in high school, you really just have to play, you know, play alongside each other and, like, stick together. You know, you have to basically clog up the middle and, like, have a um, – have an alley player coming down, making sure, you know, the seams are protected as well. Like, it's a lot of things that go into play with playing a trip option team, and it's a mind game. You know, you get one thing wrong, you know, they'll slice you right up the middle, you know. So, it's, I feel like it'll be fun playing against Citadel, and, you know, that'll be, be a great challenge for us. You see, this depends a lot of, like, spread. That's, the you know, the, the big thing in, in offenses nowadays. But what's it like kind of getting the opportunity to face kind of an old-school, you know, yeah. offensive system? I'm excited for it, you know. Um, it may be nerve-wracking for the coaches trying to come up with play calls and stuff, but I'm excited. You know, they're going to be running the ball the whole time. You know, that's what I live for. You know, I'm ready to run guys down, make tackles, and celebrate my teammates, you know, so it'll be fun. How often has Nick uh, gone back to the Georgia Southern game the last time you guys played a triple option this, this week? Uh, he kept saying, like, they put up, what, I forgot the stats. He said maybe like 200 yards, 300, 300, 300, 300. 300. Yeah, he said they put up 300 <laughs> rushing yards on us. They scored what 21 points. Yeah, he kept on going back to that and said, you know, we have to like, um, you know, play hard and stick together when we're playing and take this game serious because you know we don't want that to happen. Did he say? Sure.